Hello dear students, and today we are going to see worksheet number 4 and this worksheet is linked with the lesson Gopi and Bhagavad. Page number 27 and we are going to read a story today about a Tom. Okay? Tom White washes the fence. And in this story there are several characters involved. Let us see the characters first and then we will come back to the summary of the story. Let's say first character Tom. Okay, he is the main figure. Okay, important character in this story. Next we have okay, Tom's aunt named Polly. Next one Tom's friends Ben and Roger. Again we have the Tom's cousin Sin. Sin. So these are some characters involved in this uh, story so let's see so as I have already told you that uh, this boy Tom is little clever he wants to make his work done at any cost okay if he thinks or if he have decided that he is going to do by any means okay as we know okay by hook or by crook he will fulfill his desire so also here we will see that Tom wanted to go out for swimming with his friends on Sunday. But then we see, so he suddenly aunt calling, okay, Tom, uh, here we see Aunt Polly calling out and telling him to what was the fence, okay. Surely this disturbed him so much. But then he has to obey, okay, we can see from the face also what expired, uh, expression he has, you can see. So right, he was so disturbed. But then he has to obey and then after some time, okay, he took a bucket full of white, uh, white wash and on the other hand a brush and then came out and started painting the fence. But then, okay, as he was doing it, he just looked at the size of the fence and then thought, okay, it might take whole day as well as the night, okay, so whole day and night he will be busy with that. So as he was wondering, his friends, okay, who are his friends? Ben and Roger, okay, they came and, okay, asked him that, uh, asked him to go for swimming as they have already planned. But then, by seeing him working, okay, they told him, okay, as you are working, so you cannot come with us and see here how he, uh, how cunning he was by telling them, okay, this is an opportunity, okay. What kind of opportunity? We see towards the end. He says, okay, this isn't work, said Tom. White washing is a fun. We have never whitewashed a fence, have you? So he is asking, okay, but you have done all this kind of work. So this is not a work. Instead, what is it? It's a fun. So, and then you see, immediately the other friends, Ben and Roger, started painting the Painting what? Painting the white, this fence. And then in the meanwhile, he comes back and sits. Okay, here you can see here in the picture also, he sits and is uh, enjoying what? An apple, okay, red apple. So as I already told you in the beginning, that he will get his work done by any means, by hook or by crook. So this is what Tom is. Now let us read the story and understand the story a little better. Tom White washes the fence. It was a warm, bright Sunday. So that day, okay, the day when they decided okay, to go out. So that was a very warm and Sunday. Tom and his cousin Seed had a holiday. It was a day to enjoy, a day to have fun. Tom could hear the birds chirping in the trees. He was in a cheerful mood and was planning to go swimming with his friends. He thought of the cool water longingly. What a great time they would have. Just then he heard Aunt Polly's voice. So you see, a Sunday is a time okay, to have fun, to enjoy a bit. But then here you see, okay, as they were planning all these things, okay, they were imagining that uh, the... The water of that, okay, water of the maybe uh, pool or wherever they are going, isn't it, for swimming. So that might be a very cool and enjoyable. And they imagine, okay, what a great time. 
they are going to have but then all of a sudden he heard the voice of his aunt Polly okay Tom where are you coming aunt Polly so at once you see what a response okay how like uh, how obedient the child is the Tom is very obedient immediately he said okay coming aunt Polly said Tom and rushed to his aunt's room so immediately okay calling when he heard the voice of his aunt immediately he said coming aunt Polly and then rushed to his aunt's room I want to whitewash the fence today I want you to whitewash the fence today aunt Polly said so this is a order you can see here I want you that what does she want she want Tom to whitewash the fence by today itself but we are planning to go okay but we are planning to go swimming Tom started but he was not allowed to finish his sentence but then Aunt Polly was so strict to him the moment he said okay the see uh, the moment he started saying that they have already planned to go for swimming then immediately he was stopped saying that you cannot go anywhere till you finish the white washing Aunt Polly said and walked out of the room so what is the command the command is you cannot go anywhere till you finish the white washing the Aunt Polly said and then immediately moved out of the room Tom came out of the house sadly with a long brush and a bucket full of white wash in the other so you can see the expression of Tom here he was very much frustrated he was disappointed but he has to carry what he has to carry a brush and a bucket full of whitewash in the other hand to start his work he looked at the fence in dismay dismay means here in distressed okay caused by something unexpected so this is an appearance isn't it what kind of appearance is the appearance of disappointment when something okay you expected but then okay that thing never happened how high the fence is how long it is thought Tom so thought was, Tom was just wondering oh my god this fence is very okay very high and then okay and then long also it is very long he was just wondering okay what to do thought thought Tom Tom dipped his brush in the white wash and threw it slowly across the fence so what is he doing dipping okay dip means to put or let something down quickly in or into a liquid so what is he doing he is just dipping the brush isn't it in the bucket full of white wash and then he took it out and then started painting the fence it made us small white mark so the moment he started okay painting so definitely it will make a mark the Tom said Tom sat down near the fence it looked as though it would take the whole day and perhaps even the night to finish the work so he said okay by sitting up there it's just imagining oh my god it is going to take the whole day and night and he will have no time to go for swimming no time to spend with his friends he was just okay disappointed altogether so I hope okay all this okay whatever I have finished reading page number 27 is understood if you have any kind of uh, queries okay to make you will ask me later thank you so much